Welcome to the first Minecraft video. <sighs> this is not a let's play, not yet. We are going to be doing this sometime. This is going to be a sh short tutorial on how to become a Jedi slash Sith in Minecraft with the Legends mod, which adds Marvel heroes, DC heroes, horror characters, and Star Wars stuff like Jedi and Sith. So what you need to become a Jedi or Sith Sith, let's get a Sith Holocron. Oop. Sith. Boom, Sith Holocron. You if you want to become a Sith, you get a Sith Holocron. If you want to become a Jedi, you get a Jedi Holocron. And then all you gotta do is select the class you wanna be, click commit. You can view the abilities in each one. Same thing with the Sith. And that's that's all you gotta do to become a Jedi. But obviously you gotta you're all probably wondering how do you get these holocrons? Because they are not on the overworld. You have to go to space and go to the planet with each ho holocron. To do that, you need an observatory com link. To make one of those you need a diamond block. Five white stain, white stain titanium, which is just five titanium, five bone meal. Then you're gonna need polarized glass panel, which is basically six black iron ingots, a bunch of glass, and a color filter, which is a glass surrounded by lapis lazuli, cactus green dye, and rose red dye. And then as for the electronics, you need two high tech electronics make those you need some iron redstone you make four electronics and then you need redstone repeater four titanium now i'll make you high tech electronics and that will make you the observatory com link once you make it you use it just right click and now you're in you're in the observatory so what you want to do Let's go over here. As you can see Earth, the observatory is where we're at right now. There's Earth, Mars. If you want to become a Jedi, you go to Tython. If you want to become a Sith, you go to Korriban. We're going to go to Tython. And click on the plant, click travel. Once you're here, let's turn the weather off. There we go. This is the Jedi Temple. What you want to do is you want to run over here. Let's keep going. Actually, why don't we just fly? We're in creative. Now, once you get your holocron, you can come over here. You can use this to make a lightsaber modifier. That's where you modify your lightsaber, obviously. This guy right here, Master Arcus. can see it. He drops arm. You can buy armor from him. Costs credits. And then, um, what else? Yeah, he drops the, like the force, the Jedi robes, force apparel. He also gives you the items you need to make a lightsaber, and you can buy a holocron if you lose yours and you want to switch classes or something like that. And extensions for a lightsaber, but. That's where you go for items, armor and lightsaber parts. Now, become a Jedi. Before you go to get your lightsaber parts, you gotta go up here, you gotta run all the way up here. Keep going. Keep going up the stairs. To the right. Right here. This guy right here. I'm not going to try to say his name because I know I will say it wrong probably. You'll say greetings. You want to join the order. You click say yes. Next. It tells you the Jedi code. It tells you study the code. Do you want to do it? Yes or no? Accept. Sorry I don't qualify. That's because I'm already the legacy. But what will happen is... 
you will drop, he will give you this item, and then you are able to pick a class, and then you, that's all you, you gotta do to become a Jedi. Now, probably wondering how you get the lightsaber parts, how you buy them, because tokens and credits are not the same thing. To do that, you gotta go to Tatooine. So we're gonna, okay, just go back to this thing, observatory. Now to get credits, you wanna go to Tatooine. Tatooine, there it is. And boom, we're on Tatooine now. Oh, yeah, this, I don't know why that happens, that happens sometimes. All right, so once you're in Tatooine, you wanna go that way. Come, you'll come out there. You go all the way over here, and then you can go into the, the cantina. Oh, I can't get in for some reason. This is the cantina. This guy will give you some drinks, some food. It's nothing incredible, but this is where you get credits. So what you want to do. That's where you can craft the characters. You gotta get all this stuff and the credits. That's how you get the characters, Star Wars characters. Now to get the items, the credits I mean, sorry. Go to this guy. Say you have, say red diamonds. Say you got a bunch of red diamonds. Oh, red diamonds. Hold them in your hand. If you have them in your inventory, you find where red diamonds at. I think red diamonds one of the best is it or is it normal diamond let me look real quick Maybe diamond emeralds valuable stuff like that you I got red diamond so I would click sell and that's how you get some credits so now that we got some credits we can I'm just gonna go ahead and boom, we got some credits. That's how you get credits to buy lightsaber parts. Now to get the lightsaber crystals, you want to go back to the observatory. So for sure go to Ilum to find a lightsaber crystal. So right, here we are in Ilum. And once you get to Ilum, alright we're You are going to want to. It's my legacy. All right, now that we're on Ilum, is it? Oh, we are. Yeah, we already are. All right. So you you need to have the Crystal Harvest ability. Bond with a Kyra Crystal allows you to harvest it. So we are going to pull that back up. Actually, you already have it. So all you gotta do is assign it as an ability. So we're gonna assign it as our first ability. For for me, it's set as R. Now if you don't know what your uh, skill tree keybind is, you can look it up. I can search it because I have a mod. But for you guys, it'd be right right here. For me, it's grave. So you go here, load out, crystal harvest, boom. So now we can harvest the lights here, crystal. Once you get here, you are going to want to find a cave. Which is actually very easy. Yeah, here we go. Here's a cave. So we are in a cave. Oh, it's a dead end. Is it? Maybe it's not. Here we go. That is from another mod. That's not, is it? It might not be. I'm pretty sure that's from the mechanism mod. But yeah, here we go. Here's some lightsaber crystals. So you find the color you want. Uh, light blue. They're just kind of random. Oh, amber. So you would click the crystal harvest ability. For me, it's R. So I'm going to click R. And I'll right click it. And now it drops. And now we have a lightsaber crystal. And now we can almost make a lightsaber. Boom, we're back. So now that you have some credits, you got your lightsaber crystal, you can buy the parts and then you'll be able to make your lightsaber. So you go up to this guy, you need one of these, 
titanium power cells modulation circuits you need two I believe it's two field energizers should be two power insulator stabilizing ring vortex ring and that is all you need and a lightsaber kyber crystal of course now once you do that you're gonna go all the way you're gonna go this way you're gonna follow this path it'll take you this direction you'll keep going there'll be a tunnel I'm gonna go through it it's a nice cool little tunnel come out keep following the path you're almost there or you can cut and go that way cut cut across the path and then there is the lightsaber forge you should go in put each little thing in yep so that's all we needed now you got all the items you need you got the lightsaber crystal uh, this is the bare minimum things you need to make a lightsaber. You can make it waterproof. Uh, you can make it a shoto pointed. And if you have two lightsabers, you put the one you just I'm about to make, and then another one, and I'll make it a saber staff, dual dual blade lightsaber. But to customize the look, you just scroll through here. I'm gonna make it look like Anakin's. And there, there you go. Um, we basically have Anakin's lightsaber because it's the same color. You can mix and match the parts. You could have like uh, here Vader's or Darth Maul's emitter, and you got uh, Savage Press's switch, uh, Mace Windu's hilt body I mean lightsaber hilt body and then whoever's there that's how you customize and make a lightsaber and I'm still wearing Superman so I'm gonna take that off and boom that's how you make a lightsaber and that's all you need to make become a Jedi it's the same thing for a Sith except um, I'm gonna I'll show that actually Crap, I don't need that. So yeah, just got your lightsaber. And to get skill points. Oh. Get skill points, you just kinda fight mobs, defeat them. Then you'll get skill points, you go in here, and then you can learn some force powers. You got tons of force powers to you guys can explore that on your own. Show a bit a bunch of them. It's basically the same thing for the Sith. In fact, I'll show the Sith workbench. Sith holocron, my bad. Stark, Iron Man. There's probably an easier way to reset your legacy, but I'm just gonna do that. Why does it do that? Sith, Warrior, Commit. As you can see, it's basically the same thing. It's a little different shape. Obviously, different powers like I think force lightning somewhere around here. Yeah, there it is. Um, yeah, it's basically the same thing. If you want a red lightsaber, you oh, you go to get a crystal just like you did before an Ilum. Say we got a blue one. Here, no, we got a green one, and then. Go to your skill tree, load out, corrupt crystal. Set that as your ability, hold the crystal, press R. So I'm corrupting my crystal, I'm going to turn it red. Give that a few seconds. And boom! I got a, light, a red lightsaber crystal, but to become a Sith, you get you do the same exact thing except it's the same thing. You get your crystal, your Tython, get your parts. There's a vendor on Korriban. You're gonna go to Korriban. You'll sell or you'll buy parts from him, just like he did before for the Jedi. You'll buy parts from him with credits from Tatooine. You'll corrupt a crystal, 
once you learn how to learn that from the Sith Holocron, which I'm going to show you how to get right now. So you'll go up here, this way, and right here. This guy right here. Thanks for yes, yes, next, 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 accept. Boom. And then he'll give you a Sith Holocron. Same thing as with the Jedi. You select a class. I've already done it. Oh, have I? Yeah. Now I have it there. Now I'm a Sith Warrior. Corrupt Crystal. Corrupt Crystal. Lightsaber. You can buy lightsaber parts. Sith Armor from this dude. Right here. Item. Same thing. Now, where you build your lightsaber here is a little different. It's not outside. Go back outside of the temple, Sith Temple, and you go right down here. We're almost there. Go down these stairs. At the end of this hallway, looks like the uh, Jedi one, except it's red. Same exact thing. Put in all your parts, crystal. Select the way you want it to look. And that's all. That's all you gotta do. I will show how you make a double bladed lightsaber. So you get two sabers, and then you go put one right here, right here, and then boom. That's how you get a double bladed lightsaber. And yeah, that's that's all for the video, guys. Thanks for watching.